Hey guys, welcome to another video for the Redmi K20 Pro and the Mi 90 Pro. Now this is going to be a short one, but with every famous ROM that comes out with an update, we do make videos every two or three months of how to install that particular ROM so that you have the latest version of installation guide and you have the files available in one place. But in this video, we have something different, which I will tell you after the intro. Now, before we get into all of that, if you haven't already, please subscribe and hit that notification bell icon so that you get notified every time I upload a video in the description of each video you will find the link to our telegram community we have more than a thousand like-minded people chatting with each other so join us there last but not the least if you think the hard work is worth the effort please click on the join button and support the channel now without further ado hello awesome people welcome to phone ops my name is Kalash let's get going All right, now, before we begin, at the time of releasing this video, this ROM has not been released. I have early access, as I said, in the quick impressions video as well. So as soon as the ROM is out, I will add the download link. So please be patient and wait till then. I'm keeping the guide ready for you guys so that the moment it is released, you guys can go ahead and flash it. Till then, you need to take care of a lot of things, like make sure you have an unlocked bootloader with the K20 Pro. Even if you have an unlocked bootloader on the K20 Pro, install the latest orange fox recovery from the description mentioned below apart from that you need to make sure that you have backed up everything on your phone's internal memory because you will be losing everything like your pictures music videos from your internal storage if you've taken care of that as well you need to make sure that your phone has more than 50 percent battery before you actually go ahead and flash it and last but not the least the thing that you need to take care of you need to remove your screen lock face lock, pattern, pin unlock, all the security as well as your MI account and all the Google accounts from the device to avoid any encryption decryption issues. Now considering you're smart enough and you've tried everything and you're ready to flash and you are doing this after maybe 2-3 hours of releasing this video because by then 9 or 10 o'clock Indian time the ROM would have been released. Here's what we are going to do. Now there is only one, only one and only one file that you will need. That is the Abix ROG ROM file because it is based on the China beta. You don't need a vendor. You don't need firmware. Okay, you can use DFE. You can use Magisk if you want to stay decrypted or if you want root access after flashing the ROM, you can go ahead and flash that. For now, what I've done here is I have downloaded the file and kept it in the phone's internal memory as you can see over here. And we've taken care of everything so as I said you know let's go to security over here and let's remove the screen lock and let's turn off the screen lock okay next thing let's remove the MI account okay now the MI account is gone let's go ahead and remove the Google account so Google more remove account remove all right now, to confirm, you need to reboot the device once. All right, now once the device has rebooted, let me show you that I have removed everything, including the fingerprint scanner. So I have removed everything at this point. Now we will go ahead and reboot to TWRP because we have the ROM downloaded. You need to press and hold volume up and power. Now I would highly recommend you use the latest Orange Fox recovery because that for the K20 Pro works wonders and I have not had any problems with this particular recovery at all you know flashing from oss to miui vendor flashing from china beta to india stable or india stable to china beta or china stable it has worked absolutely fine now what i've observed over here is if you remove the lock screen security and everything it will not ask you for a lock screen password over here okay so the first thing that you need to do is you need to go to wipe Dalvik cache system vendor data we won't be wiping internal storage because that's where our rom is Okay, so we wiped everything. Now let's go here and let's select the ROM zip and swipe to confirm flash. Now, while this is flashing, you will understand the importance why you need a guide like these for you know ROMs like these. First things first, this is a ROM which is based on MIUI. The size of the ROM is around three gigabytes. So it will take its own sweet time to flash. So please be very, very patient while that happens. At the same time, you need to ensure that while this is being flashed, 
you don't run into any errors and the reason i said you need more than 50 percent battery because this is one of the longest first boot roms that i've seen it actually took me i don't know maybe three to five minutes for it to get to boot for the first time so if it is taking for you five minutes or six minutes don't panic just leave the phone alone and go play on your pc or have a cup of coffee or do something and come back and you will see that it is on the setup screen now let's wait for this rom to boot flash completely and then we will boot into the rom all right now as you can see the rom has flashed so just make sure you've not had any errors any red colored warning signs now at this point you can go ahead and flash magisk at this point you can go ahead and flash dfe it's completely up to you for me i don't do any of those so let's go ahead and click on reboot system right now as i said the first boot will take anywhere between three to five minutes so please be patient while that happens the only thing that you will see during this first boot up is the rog boot animation which in my opinion looks great it's yeah but it's not something you can watch for five minutes so just go ahead and do something else five to seven minutes leave the phone alone and i assure you it will boot up all right so as you can see we are on the setup screen and we have booted we are quickly going to skip through the setup part so that we can confirm that the rom has booted just fine all right so we are on the home screen let's go to settings over here let's go to abix rog i know it's a little too bright let's reduce the brightness maybe but as you can see over here 12.6 by abix rog edition 21.8.18 it is working smooth as expected this is just the first boot the device is not even set up yet and it is working smoother than you would expect so you know this is a quick install guide step by step the rom will be released 10 o'clock indian time today i've confirmed with the developer wait for the download link try it out let me know in the comment section tomorrow or day after we will have a gaming review out for this particular rom until the next one, this is Kalash signing off at Phone Ops. Keep smiling. Take care. Goodbye.